name is Giselle and welcome to Music Foundation YouTube Video Lesson 13. What is practice? So according to Oxford Dictionary, practice is perform an activity or exercise, a skill repeatedly or regularly in order to improve or maintain one's proficiency carry out or perform a particular activity, method, or custom habitually or regularly. That's from Oxford Dictionary. So what is practice? You wanna create a practice space, number one. You wanna make sure that your keyboard, your guitar, there is a space in your room, living room, even if it's a corner that you're able to practice. Number two, Create a practice routine. I'm very happy to give you a free practice download that you can get on my website. So check that out. The link is on my bio for that free download. Number three, set goals for yourself. Do you want to perform at your local cafe? Do you want to continue this professionally? Um, in a music education route. There's so many ways about that you can create a goal. Maybe you just want to get through a semester. It could be any attainable goal. Number four, remove all distractions. So no texting between... Um... Number five, record yourself. You want to record how you're playing. Um, you can compare and contrast how you're playing as well from the first day you started to the last day you've been playing number seven hire a music teacher or go to your local music school there are a lot of great teachers that will give you professional advice and help you and it's good to hear constructive criticism from a professional who will help you advance in your goal number seven don't repeat your mistakes you notice yourself um, playing and you're just not getting it just take a minute stop don't keep practicing your mistakes don't create bad habits just take a minute maybe go to the next um, measure or next phrase and then go back to it number eight analyze your music take a second Break down what's going on if you're a pianist on your treble clef, your bass clef. If you're a guitarist, break down what's going on in your music before you play. Analyze it. Sit down. Write the fingering. Write any notes, any ledger notes that you're having trouble with. Anything that you need help with, write it down. Number nine, warm up. As a vocalist, you might want to massage your cheeks. Go through a few breathing um, warm-ups. As a pianist, warm up your hands before you play. Number 10, review your scales, chords, arpeggios, or other technique exercises. There are hand and exercises that will further warm up your fingers. They have muscles in them too. Um, you wouldn't just start working out without warming up. Same thing with your hands, same thing with your mouth. You want to make sure when you're beginning to learn a piece practice slowly first take a minute get the right hand first get the left hand if you're a pianist too get both hands together and practice slowly once you are ready with both the right hand and the left hand and you're ready to focus more on rhythm or if you're even starting with focusing on rhythm use a metronome they help you um, they help you keep a steady, consistent pace throughout your music where you need to. Number And lastly, celebrate when you reach your goals. Maybe go to your favorite restaurant. Do your favorite things when you achieve your own goals. What are your goals? Feel free to DM me. Feel free to leave a comment or message me. All right, that will be all for this lesson. Have a beautiful rest of the week.